For fast, cheap and reliable individual match tax and now discounted Adrenaline XL and match tax products, check out tradingcardcollective.co.uk with the link below. Uh, use the discount codes on the screen for 10% off cards. Hey guys, WB Trading Cards here and welcome back to another video. Uh, today we do have an entire booster box of the Adrenaline XL Road to Russia 2018 uh, World Cup collection to open. And yeah, you can see the box here. Um, it does contain 36 packs inside, all of which I'll be opening in today's video. And each pack does retail at one pound. Um, so it's got this seal on, which we'll get off and have a closer look at the box. All right, so here it is. You can see a very simple design on the outside, actually. Uh, no players or anything on there. Uh, we've just got a few examples of what the packs look like there. And then, yeah, some logos as well. And that's pretty much it on the outside. Of course, this is the collection um, leading up to the World Cup next year in Russia. And yeah, it is an official licensed FIFA collection, of course, uh, with the Drone XL now holding the rights for all international teams, um, including England, which match tax held for a while and yeah here are what the packs look like so we've got 18 on each side there and they're each nine player packs which is what they are in the uk collection uh, there's the front on the front of this one we have got kevin de bruyne messi hummels coutinho and vidal uh, so it's nice to have a collection with all of the best players in the world in basically um, in the international scene um, and then on the back we have got the odds um, so you can see there's 385 teammates in the collection and they're split um, 18 cards for most of the 31 teams in the collection but then there's three teams Algeria, Australia and New Zealand which have just nine cards um, there's also 31 rising stars 12 defensive rocks uh, one in four packs key players and gold machines also 12 of each of them also at one in four packs then we've got fans favorites 49 of them at one in two packs game changers one in six experts one in ten and top players are the ones to watch out for they're one in every 33 packs so uh, hopefully we can get at least one of them in today's booster box along with some other cards as well and we'll get straight into the first pack and in this one uh, we do start off with Darren Randolph, teammate from Ireland. And then we do have a very nice card in the first pack, Sergio Aguero, uh, just his teammate card though from uh, Argentina, of course. Then we've got our first insert of the opening with Kirikes, a uh, fan's favorite from Romania. And we also have Podjan Palo, a gold machine from Finland, followed by Hoban and then Miranda teammate, Tony Cruz and Stansu, and at the end, this is Blazikowski, uh, his teammate card of Poland, of course. Um, so, as usual with these bigger openings, I won't be going through every card we get, um, just the good ones, really. But, yeah, opening every pack in today's video. And in the next one, uh, we do start off with Matt Ritchie from Scotland and Newcastle. Um, then we also in this pack have our two inserts. So Chiro Mobile, another goal machine um, in this second pack from Italy this time. And we've also got another fan's favourite. So we're doing pretty well uh, so far with inserts. Still early days though. Fletcher from Scotland. Uh, then we've got Kirikas' base card. Followed by Akinfi from the host Russia. And Kadir as well. Boateng, two nice Germany pulls there. And also Arda Turan. So a pretty good pack in that second one. Uh, into pack number three and in this one we do have Glenn Whelan teammate of uh, Republic of Ireland then we've got Ricardo Rodriguez uh, Casemiro rising star Batuayi rising star as well from Chelsea of course Fernandez also and then just one insert is yet another gold machine though we've got Milik from Poland and we also in this pack have Piszczek from Poland as well. Um, so the 2018 World Cup, I'll also talk a bit about that in this video. So obviously there is a few problems facing the World Cup in 2018. Probably nowhere near as many as there are in the 2022 uh, World Cup, which will of course be held in Qatar. Uh, we've got Daniel Storis there, that's a nice pull. And also our first key player with Granite Xhaka and then uh, Davies, fan favorite. Uh, also in that pack, Sahin there, 
and Iniesta. There's a nice one to get 87 on control. Henderson as well, and Forsberg at the end. Um, so yeah, few problems. One of them being the the size of Russia. Uh, Russia is of course the biggest country in the world. I think it covers a sixth of the earth. Um, so. Yeah, getting between games could be pretty hard, even though it's mostly going to be held in the west region of Russia. Um, but that's one of the problems. Obviously, there's also hooliganism is a big thing. Uh, we've got Pique as well. And then Pepe, defensive rock. And a very nice card here, Expert Manuel Neuer in just the fifth pack. Um, so that's a really good one to get. 97 on defense for him. And I think Expert's one in 10 packs. And that is, by the way, a very nice looking card as well. Um, so our first kind of rare card of the opening. We've got Chan Loglu as well, Hector, and then Busquets, and also Moutinho. Um, so yeah, hooliganism in Russia. Of course, there's been plenty of problems with Russian fans, especially clashing with the English um, at Euro 2016. So, yeah, that could be interesting. Um, and I am actually hoping to go to at least some of the games in the Russia World Cup myself. So we've got Brahimi there, uh, Axel Witzel also, and then Moreno. Um, and we also do have uh, Shakiri. And then I'll insert of this one is a game changer card. Game changer that one in six packs, and that is Memphis Depay of the Netherlands, whose career has been a bit rejuvenated by moving to Lyon. Um, so yeah, I hope to go to some of the games at the Russia 2018 World Cup. My 18th birthday is actually two days before the World Cup final. Um, so if I could make it to that, that would be absolutely amazing. Um, but yeah, English fans clashing with the Russians has been a problem in the past. Anyway, moving on to this next pack, and in this one, uh, we got fan favourite Danny Alves, um, the legend, well, coming on to be a legend for Brazil and currently at Juventus. Um, also in this pack, we have got Stecklenburg, and then Gundogan, um, and also Murillo, and Yilmaz, goal machine for Turkey at the end. Uh, as we move on to packet number nine or so, about a quarter of the way through, and still looking for that top player, um, if we can get one in today's opening, but we've got, I think, all of the other um, inserts apart from defensive rocks, which is pretty good going for so early on. And we've got MacArthur in this next pack, Ben Taleb as well, Gareth Bale with 86 on attack, uh, then Hector Baron, Rising Star, and also... Uh, Krychowiak, key player for Poland. He's a good one to get. Then we've got David Silva, teammate, and Funes Mori, teammate, at the end there as well. Uh, and with this Panini collection, they have actually introduced quite a lot of new stuff. So um, there's some stuff that we've never seen in the UK, at least in the time I've been collecting Adrenaline XL, and that is premium and premium gold packs, which of course I will be opening on the channel. We've got McGeady in this next pack, though. Um, and yeah, both of those, they guarantee the insert cards you'll get, or at least like what type of insert. And we do have a defensive rock here, which means we have now got every insert apart from the uh, top player cards. So that defensive rock is Moisander from Finland. Uh, we've also got Gira in this pack, fans favourite card. Then Juru and uh, Lod, then Hradiki and Jara. And finally, Wood uh, from New Zealand at the end there. Um, so yeah, they've bought out these premium packs. They haven't got multi-packs this time around, um, but the other products that we've still got to work on, we've got the mega tins, the mini tins, and then the premium packs and the premium gold packs as well, which should be interesting. They're more expensive, premium priced at £3.99, and premium golds, I believe, at £7.99. Uh, so we should get some good cards in them. Uh, in this next pack though, we've got Macaulay. And then Meza Urzel as well, uh, followed by Kalinic Goal Machine. And we've got another game changer there, and that is a very good one. It is Arturo Vidal, game changer with 94 on his control stat. Um, we've also got Kezaru, uh, followed by Benucci, Medel, Bravo, and Barzagli. A very good pack there with the base and the inserts. Um, in two. Packet number 
about 13, I think, uh, out of the 36. So about a third of the way. And Angel Di Maria is the standout there. We've also got Game Changer Kalinic and then Henriksen fan favourite, uh, followed by Hummels. And then um, we do have Marcus Rojo, Versalco, and then Matuidi. And finally Diaz at the end there for Chile. Into the next one. And I think the opening's going pretty well so far. It's definitely nice to get a booster box open. This is over a 500 card collection. Um, so we've got Shane Long in this one. And yeah, so 36 packs, 36 packs of nine is uh, 324 cards, I believe. Um, so yeah, we should make a good start in the collection. We've got Kalinic Goal Machine, then Pogba Game Changer. We are doing really well with the Game Changers at the moment. Um, Paul Pogba, 99 on control for him. And then we've got Carl Walker and Diego Costa, followed by Paulinho, and then Morata, and finally Cardona of Colombia. Uh, into the next one though, and by the way, this is probably will be quite a long video. Um, so, if you do want to watch the whole thing, more than one sittings uh, might be a good idea. In the next one, we've got Ward, Pepe, uh, Komen, and then Lenogo, and also Alderweireld, uh, Kadar, and then Andone fans' favourite from Romania. And they've got Otamendi teammate, and Kovacic teammate as well. Uh, into the next one where we've got Andrew Robertson from Scotland started off. Um, then we've got Alassami and also Eric Dyer, key player uh, from England, the young midfielder. Um, then we've got Robertson as well and Eric Dyer's teammate card as well there. And then Mena, um, followed by Graham. McGinley is our next one from New Zealand. And then we've got Mascherano as well. Uh, so a couple of England, well a couple of Eric Dyer cards in that pack. And yeah, England doing alright in qualification as per usual, unbeaten so far in their five games. Uh, however, if we've learned anything from the past few international competitions, it's that uh, it doesn't really matter how well England does in qualifying. We've got Ward there in the next pack, then De Gea. And then we do have our top player card, or our first one of the opening, and it is Lionel Messi, uh, arguably the best player around. Definitely one of the best two players in the world, so that is a very nice pull to get, especially in the first half of the opening as well. 100 on attack for him, and 98 on control. And yet, yeah, that is a really nicely designed card as well there. Uh, I can't remember what they call it, but it's got some weird name, this design. Um, but yeah, Lionel Messi, top player, we'll leave that one out. That is the standout of the opening so far. Probably will be. Well, it's one of the best cards um, that you can get. We've got Gary Cahill, Defensive Rock as well in that pack. And then Vida. And also uh, Guerra as well uh, in that pack. So, how many top players is there? There's like five or six. Yeah, five top players. So we've got the first one ticked off uh, with Lionel Messi. Into the next pack though, and um, we've got McGovern um, and then Osby Rackley. Uh, Juba as well, top rack, and then Ospina, Achoa, and our insert of this one is Sergio Ramos, defensive rock, the captain of Spain, uh, with 95 on defence on that one, uh, on the Real Madrid defender. That's a very nice pull as well. Uh, and we've got Corona and then Augusto uh, at the end of that pack. Um, into packet number 17 now. So one packet down from halfway. Uh, we've got Walters and then uh, Lam and also Cocker and Goal Machine and then Ospina fans favourite again. Uh, we've got Buffon as well. Uh, and Rogers, Tosson, and then Victor Fischer, teammate card. Um, he was once a pretty hot prospect uh, at Denmark. And into packet number 18. So this one does take us halfway through the opening. 
And here we begin with Stephen Davis, uh, Rogic, Kimmich, Castillo, and then Koscielny, Paul Pogba, and also Gidetti, fan favourite, and we've got Birgit and Diamande uh, as well from Norway. And here we go, into the second half. If the second half can match the first half of the opening, um, that would definitely make a very good start to my collection, um, especially with that top player, Messi. Uh, we've got Gordon to start off this next pack, and then Mario Gomez. And two inserts in this one, we've got Granvist, and then uh, Zerkov expert card from Russia. And we've also got Salaj, Yilmaz, Wijnaldum, Gomez, and Jorgensen. Uh, at the end. Moving on to the next pack, we've got Duffy, uh, then Adam Lalana, teammate card, and we've also got uh, Moisander, defensive rock, and fans' favourite Hoiberg, um, and then Dimitri Payet, um, the one who's now back at Marseille after leaving. Uh, West Ham in controversial circumstances in January. We've got Charisma as well, uh, Gomez and Baca. Yeah, Dimitri Payet, uh, now hated by most West Ham fans, understandably, uh, after committing his future to the club and then leaving after refusing to play. Um, we've also got Paddy McNair, rising star uh, from Northern Ireland, and then Brad Smith, Corich, Gadetti. And Thibaut Courtois, the Chelsea and Belgium goalkeeper who always seems to be linked away from Chelsea uh, at the moment. And we've got Stecklenburg expert as well from the Netherlands. And Nani and then Desmali. Yeah, Netherlands really struggling internationally at the moment uh, after not qualifying for the Euro 2016. And um, yeah, I think now struggling in the World Cup qualification as well. Um, so they're not going through a good time. We've got Felipe Coutinho. Brazil have definitely improved um, in how they're doing. And we've got Iron Robin as well, 82 on attack for him. And then our insert here is Goal Machine Jimenez uh, from Mexico. And the Vitolo and then Golo Kante, the PFA Player of the Year in the Premier League. And that's a really nice pull to get. He's only rated 79 on control there, um, so which makes me wonder how long ago this collection was compiled. Uh, we got Whelan, and then yeah, and he's only 76 on defence, which is of course his best asset. And we got Vargas as well. And then Christian Eriksen, key player. He is certainly going to be a key player for Denmark next summer if they do make it to the competition. Uh, we've also got MacArthur fans' favourite. And then Romero, Barami, Hennessy, and also uh, Andone at the end there for uh, Romania. Into the next pack, though. And in this one, we've got Cathcart. Uh, followed by Murillo, and then Lindolf, and also Macaulay fan favourite, then Bar Barus, uh, sorry about the pronunciation, we've got Chris Gunter, and then uh, at the end there, that is Franson for Sweden. And so around 10 packs remaining now of the opening to get another big pull, um, either a top player or uh, maybe an expert. Another expert would be nice as well uh, in these last 10 packs would be good. Um, but we've got McGuinness and then Marcus Rashford, rising star for England. Uh, the host of the nation really resting on him to come out good. Uh, we've got Slimani as well and then uh, Puki, Eder. And then Liechtenstein, a fan's favourite, uh, followed by Joshua King, who is, of course, Norwegian. And then Hillmark as well uh, at the end for Sweden. Yeah, so I think this is the 10th last pack now. And this one we start off with Robert Snodgrass for Scotland. And then we've got Luka Modric with 89 on control for the Real Madrid man. 
Um, that's another nice one. And we've also got Game Changer Boy in this really good pack. 95 on his control um, for the brilliant Belgian. And then our other insert, Marco Verratti as well. What a pack that is. Um, look at those four or those three cards and that we've managed to get in a row. Marco Verratti with 93 on control on his key player. And we've got Teddy as well and the Verratti's base card and William teammate. Another player linked away from Chelsea in the summer. Uh, moving into this next one. And here we do have Coleman and then uh, Ring and also Murata Gold Machine and Muriel Game Changer uh, for Colombia with 93 on attack. Uh, we've got Carvalho as well, Danny Alves, Biglia, Willian, again, Willian in back-to-back -back packs there is a bit annoying. And we've got Krajcowiak uh, for Poland. Moving into the next one, uh, where we do have McCarthy teammates, and then Vestergaard, and also uh, Kaya, Defensive Rock, and then Rakitic fans' favourites. We've got Guerrero. And Fellaini, Nangolan, uh, Stocker, and then Jaguev uh, at the end for Russia. And now eight packs remaining, including this one. So we've got Rob Robbie Brady. Um, then we do have Benzar, Ru Patricio. And Gonzalo Higuain, the fantastic Argentinian striker uh, at Juventus after his big mo money move in the summer and doing really well for them. Uh, we've also got Kurzawa. And then the insert of this pack is fans' favourites. Um, Sahin, that is. And then we've got Memedy and Candreva uh, at the end for Italy. And yeah, we haven't had any really good pulls in a while. Um... I think the last one was probably that game changer De Bruyne. Um, but we've got Tierney in this next pack, then Svensson, and two inserts with Morata Gold Machine, and then Arda Turan game changer. Another nice game changer to get 93 uh, for the Barcelona man. And then we've got Williams, Carrasco, and also uh, Daily Blind at the end there for the Netherlands. Uh, moving on to the next one, we've got Daryl Murphy, Depay, and then Starley. Uh, Goal Machine, not sure how to pronounce that one. But we also have Koke fans' favourite there with 88 on control. And then Martinez, uh, Chester, and Felipe Luiz for Brazil at the end of that pack. And our five packs remaining, including this one. Um, where we start off with Johnny Evans, teammate card, and then we've got uh, who's that? Bernard Deschi uh, from Italy. And then key player Paulinho is a nice one to get, of course, now playing in the Chinese league, um, but still for Brazil as well. Lafferty also, then Kalik, and Ericsson, Joe Hart, Chester, and Marinovic uh, at the end there for New Zealand. Um, so Paulinho, of course, in the Chinese league, and it looks like his fellow Brazilian-born Diego Costa might be set to join him in the summer on a £650,000 a week contract, which is insane. That would make him the world's highest paid player. Um, but we've got Forrest in the next pack, and then Casemiro, rising star, Rodriguez, and then Erkin, Quadrado teammate for Colombia, Mandzukic, uh, then Aaron Ramsey, key player, for Wales, I've also got Poulsen and then Koluka uh, at the end for Croatia. And now just three packets remaining of today's opening. And in this one, uh, we do have Dallas, um, and then we've got Klaassen, followed by Milik, Goal Machine, Joe Ledley fans favourite. Eden Hazard is a nice teammate to get towards the end. Only 83 on attack. Uh, I think he's played a bit above that this season. And yeah, that shows Olivier Giroud equal on attack to Hazard. Although he has had his periods of form this season. 
Uh, and at the end we've got Aussie Cup for Turkey. And now just two packs left. Um, and in the second to last one we've got Griffith, then Vidal, and also uh, Hector Herrera. And then Hummel's defensive rock, um, the Germany man, 97 on defence for him. And then we've got Delaney, Gary Cahill, and also uh, Kianek finishing off that pack for Poland. And then the final one, I'm not sure if face cam is working right now, um, but yeah, it will be back if it's not on the next video. Um, in this last one though, we've got Hanley, and then Brahimi. Uh, Odegaard, um, the young, highly rated Norwegian star, uh, rising star on that card. Uh, Dost as well, and then Koke, and our final insert is Wayne Rooney, expert card. Um, that's a relatively nice way to finish it off. Hasn't really got to where he possibly could have in the international game, although being England's top scorer, so that definitely qualifies him as an expert. Um, but yeah, still... Maybe could have got a bit further with his potential. We've got Silver as well and Gamero to finish the opening of France. And uh, yeah, still the standout of today's opening is, of course, that Lionel Messi top player card with 100 on attack. Um, but yeah, some very nice other pulls in the collection. And look out for plenty more Adrenaline XL videos coming on the channel soon. If you did enjoy today's, please do smash that thumbs up button. And of course, I'll see you next time.